A340 Opening and closing of engine cowl doors. Opening of fan cowl doors. Warning Do not open the fan cowls when the engine is running or if the wind speed is more than 65 knots. You must first follow the safety precautions and prepare the aircraft to operate on engines. Unlock the three latches by releasing the latch handles and pulling the latch handles down to disengage the latch hooks. Release the hold open rod from the stow bracket. Extend the hold open rod. Attach the hold open rod to the attach bracket on the engine case. Repeat the operation for the second hold open rod. Be careful, both hold open rods must be engaged when fan cowl is open. Repeat the same procedure to open the opposite fan cowl door. Opening of thrust reverser cowl doors. Caution, do not open the thrust reverser half door if the wind speed is more than 40 knots or if the fan cowl hold open rods are attached to the half doors. Make the thrust reverser unserviceable. After removing the HCU pin, Move the thrust reverser inhibition lever to the unserviceable position and install the lockout pin to lock the lever. On the thrust reverser inhibition lever, put a warning notice to tell persons not to remove the lockout pin from the inhibition lever in the unserviceable position. Warning. Sudden closure of half doors could cause serious injury to personnel. All personnel must be clear of the area under and between the half doors when you open or close the reverser cowl. Open the blowout door and disconnect the safety cable. Release each of the five thrust reverser door latches. After you disengage the hook, move the latch handle back to the hook. The latch will stay open and one person can do the opening procedure. Caution! Retract the wing slats before you open the thrust reverser cowl or damage can occur. Install the hand pump by connecting the hose to the quick disconnect on the hydraulic junction box. Operate the hand pump to open the half doors to the maintenance position.
put the hold open rods in position on the half doors. Open the relief valve of the hand pump. Secure the hold open rods. Disconnect the pump from the quick disconnect of the hydraulic junction box. The two half doors are open. Closing of thrust reverser cowl doors. Install the hand pump by connecting the hose to the quick disconnect on the hydraulic junction box. Operate the pump to pressurize the opening actuator and remove the load from the hold open rod. Disconnect the hold open rod and put it in the stowed position. Open the relief valve on the hand pump to let the thrust reverser cowl close. Wait for at least 30 seconds after the thrust reverser cowl closure before you disconnect the hand pump. Disconnect the hose of the hand pump. Remove the turnbuckle from its storage bracket. Put the turnbuckle in position on the brackets located on the center latch fitting and tighten it with a wrench until the clearance between the two half doors permits the latches to engage. Close and lock the thrust reverser door latches. If you find any latch not aligned with the adjacent thrust reverser cowl surface, open the latches and close them again until the latches are correctly aligned. Connect the blowout door safety cable and close the blowout door. Remove the warning notice. Reactivate the thrust reverser by moving the thrust reverser inhibition lever to the serviceable position. Closing of fan cowl doors. Pull the locking collar to release the hold open rod from the attach bracket on the engine. Retract the hold open rod. Attach the hold open rod to the stow bracket on the fan cowl doors. Make sure that the hold open rod locks on the attach bracket. Lower the fan cowl doors and push them together to engage the door latches. Close the latches. Make sure that all latch handles are correctly aligned with the adjacent surface. If not, open the latches and close them again until the latches are correctly closed.